Hello there, I'm Natasha Koo, the founder of Feminine Space, and welcome to day 16 of this beautiful journey as we redefine womanhood for ourselves. And today we're going to be talking all about how can we feel worthy of our dreams and of a completely new change or transformation in our lives. So let's dive in. In the last video from yesterday, the day 15 video, I talked a little about how sometimes when we really are craving for something from our heart to live out a certain life or to have a certain something, we might be meeting that same desire at that level with fear. And today I want to introduce another layer to that concept, to that experience, which is at the very bottom of that issue or that experience is actually our belief that we are not good enough and we're not actually worthy of having all of that. So I really want to hone in on this topic with you, especially as we, you know, each are on our journey to redefine womanhood for ourselves to make these positive changes so that we feel really good every day of our lives is to look at what our dream is, but also to take a look at whether we accept the responsibility that we are alive and everything that comes along with being human and being alive here. So what that means is that we need to take a very unbiased and honest look at what this actually opportunity to be a human, to be alive as a woman today actually means. So in reality, there's no one in the course of history that's like you. Not before you, not in the future. There's only uniquely one of you. And whatever your heart desire is, whatever it is that you wish to express or to create in this life, or to even feel, that's an experience that only you can live out and it's ex this experience is unique to you. So there's something that you're here to embody. You're alive for a very special reason and only you can figure that out. And sometimes when we grow up in an environment or we hear people saying, or implying that we're not good enough, that we should become quiet, we shouldn't be our true selves, we dim down who we really are. And the world, you, don't get to actually have and experience this gift of you. And the first step that we can take if we want to change the course of our lives is to begin to take full responsibility for what is actually here. The gifts you have, the body you have, this life that is coursing through you, and the uniqueness that is within you. Because if we truly believe that we shouldn't occupy this space, we shouldn't speak up, no one is interested in what we have to share or say or be, then we don't even make room for that self-expression. We don't even give ourselves the chance to go out there and give back to this world. When it comes to unworthiness, it can be such a deep-rooted hurt and pain, and we believe it to such a degree that we even feel like we shouldn't exist. And that's actually the root problem when we find ourselves people pleasing, saying yes to all sorts of obligations and commitments when they in reality don't resonate with ourselves, but we do that anyways just to give, just to please others, just to make others happy. At the end of the day, if we keep doing that, we're just trying to prove that we're valuable, we're trying to prove that we, we, we should be here that we are giving value some way or another to this universe. But the fact is, you are here alive. 
and the value innately within who you are, that's infinite. And that's something that I can't even describe because it's such a mystical, like a magical thing that you're even here being you in this very moment. So feel into that. Feel into the fact that your breath has carried you on from the beginning until now. And this breath will keep entering your body and fueling you until your very last day or last breath. So what are you going to do? Are you going to keep playing small and rob this world of what you actually have to give? Are you going to take on the ownership that you're alive and that there's only one of you in this history in the course of time? And are you going to actually own up to that? Own up this wonderful opportunity to be who you are, to discover who you are, and then to express from that authentic place, from that true self, and to give to the world. I really feel that when we are just drowning in our own unworthiness and self-hatred and sabotage, we're robbing not only of ourselves, we're not the only ones who are drowning when we're depressed, when we're playing small. We're robbing of the whole world. We are dimming our own light. And in this way, we're, we're dimming our dreams. And if we do not allow ourselves to go for those huge opportunities, the things, however scary they may be, that just makes our heart come alive, that makes us tingle with energy, if we're not out there doing these things, there are so many people that are not going to be impacted by it. And we are withholding so much good. And that is what you're made of. Goodness. So I hope that this video has touched on a very special topic about unworthiness. Because when we feel this way and we believe that we are unworthy, it has such a bigger influence on your life and this world like you can ever imagine. And I really want to share with you the uniqueness that is within you that no one else can bring to this world. And it's up to us to step out of that, to consciously say, I'm alive, I'm alive for a reason, I'm going to own up to this opportunity to be myself because in this life, it's not worth it to play it small. It's not worth it to try to be someone else because I will never be anyone else anyways. And to own up to the fact that there's this beautiful expression within you that wishes to come out. There's a beautiful expression of femininity, of being a woman that's unique to you. And you have the power not only to feel so much joy and to love yourself, but to spread that to your sisters, to this world, and it just keeps carrying on. It's, it's, you can just do one action, do one very thing, and it'll change the whole world, and it'll, 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 like a domino effect from one action, from one thing that you choose to change or do, to start to change the course of history into the future from that very moment. So I want to tell you that this is the power you have. No matter how hopeless, how worthless we may feel, that is your value. You have as much power to create an enormous impact that we can barely fathom, that's for sure. So I hope that this video has helped you maybe shed light to what it really means to be alive and what we are truly capable of and why it's important to actually begin to take control of your life, to start, you know, not just watching these videos, but begin to look deeper into what does that mean for my life and what can I really do to embody that and begin to feel so worthy, so valuable, just being who I am. So if you feel like you ever need any support in terms of the sisterhood or even just further um, guidance in terms of coaching, then feel free to reach out to me or look at the links below. You can always write me whatever concerns or questions you may have at natashaatfemininespace.com 
and um, also for your sisterhood you're welcome to join the free uh, group at feminintribe.com so this is this is completely your decision and the only thing that you need to do is to take a moment to say yes to yourself and to say yes to the experience that's before you and to take back the control in your life so that you can do and be all the things that you've always wanted to because there's no better time to shine to be authentic to stop living a life that just feels so draining and just not you so let's do that together we're on this journey together and you can truly truly do this for yourself so let's set ourselves free and tomorrow I look forward to another video with you as we keep on going on this journey to redefine womanhood for ourselves and to regain an alignment to who we really are and bringing that out back into this world. So thanks so much for watching and bye!